What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. So the last video we left off with picking up the convertible RX-7 from Mako. They did a great job with the paint job. Have everything looking really nice. Um, the only thing we have to do now, we have to assemble everything that I took off before dropping off the car and get this car cleaned up a little bit because it's a little dirty. So I have most of the stuff that I took off over here from when I got the car painted. So all this stuff that pa was painted that was taken off the car is on this table. And I took off the tail lights again because I didn't put the new seal gasket kit on yet. One of the few things I wanted to do for the car, um, I wanted to get these stock seats looking semi-decent because I did order the seat cover, uh, OEM seat covers that cover these seats. And they haven't come in yet. It takes a few, um, I think about two months to make. And then once I get them in, um, I have to upholster everything. I have to um, put everything on with the hog ties and all that stuff. So um, basically, I'm going to try to repair these and dye this over here that's a little faded. So dye the whole seat. And for the driver's side, I've done it to my Hummer seat before. So instead of just stitching this up, I'm going to actually try to glue these seams together shave down these ends and then re-dye these seats and hopefully it gets a good coverage around where these cracks and wrinkles are just to have it presentable for the show um, like i said i have some new covers on their way and they're not going to be here in time but i want this car to look decent once the top is dropped and everything um, i do have a race and beat um, header back exhaust full exhaust that i wanted to get installed hopefully i can get that installed tomorrow morning before the show because tomorrow is seventh day and we're all meeting up at the park and we're gonna do the city thing and everything like that. But I'm gonna to try to get everything done right now. Of course, I had to um, do a lot of errands this morning which cut into my assembly time. But right now, I just gotta get going. really clean
everybody. So I couldn't sleep last night. I woke up at three o'clock in the morning. Um, I just decided to come out to the garage and just work on the car and actually finish the project. I didn't want too much to do in the morning when I woke up on the actual show day. So right now it's about 5.30 in the morning. I've been working on this for about two hours. Let me just show you guys how everything looks. All right, so I finished putting on the lip and relining everything up. I adjusted the front coil over. The car was riding a little too low and I couldn't get a full turn. So I raised that up about a half an inch on both sides. So that's looking and sitting really nice. And I lowered the rear about an inch and a half. The rear was actually jacked up like a monster truck. I didn't realize I didn't even touch them when I installed the uh, coilovers. I didn't even adjust the ride height, but now it's sitting perfect. Um, one more thing, I was going to repair this seat and actually die to see if it's going to dry in time, but that would have been like ridiculous. It would have been too much and I don't think the seats would have been ready anyway. So I decided to put in the Turbo 2 seat that I have for Project Bane in here. I cleaned them up a little bit and the, the seats look great. So Brian, you know who you are. Thanks a lot. If you're watching the video, thanks for selling me these seats. Um, this cool guy came down from Massachusetts and I bought him while I was at work and thanks again, man for that So um, everything's looking good. All the lights are in uh, Car ride height is looking nice Didn't get a chance to clean it yet So I'm gonna go in and get a few hours of sleep cuz I only slept about an hour Woke up because I had this anxiety that I'm gonna actually miss the show again and not have my car ready this year again so cars all cleaned up and the last detail that I put on the car was my Rotary Spirit sticker along with 2021 Sevens Day sticker. Now it was actually at 2022 Sevens Day but I didn't get a sticker because I rode the Eclipse. But I mean you guys knew I had about a couple rotors. You could have gave me a sticker. I mean me and Dion are collecting these stickers now so we want to keep a collection of them. But you guys could have gave me a sticker even though I had my Eclipse. You knew I was wearing that Mazda shirt last year. So anyway, if you do have any of them, if anybody's watching this, if you do have any of them from 2022, I'm willing to pay for it. Just hit me up in the comment section or hit me up on Instagram, turbo double underscore pat, and I'll, I'll definitely purchase one off you or two because Dion's going to want one. If you haven't yet, hit that subscribe button so you can see everything that's coming out on the channel. The FD is done and we're going to bring it at home in another week. Um, Jim's just ironing out the wrinkles just to make sure it's working perfect before he hands it off to me. And um, there's gonna be more contact coming out of for this car because I'm getting a new set of rims and we got a motor swap that we're gonna be doing on this. But the FD is gonna be coming home and Project Bane is gonna be before we even do that motor swap. And um, the Talon is actually coming out of hibernation. It's being worked on too. So we have a lot of contact coming out of this garage, my personal garage, and we got some lifts going up. You probably saw them in the background. That video is coming up soon too. So again, thank you for watching this video and always love and peace. I ran up a check, I might do it again. Enemies close, have me thinking they're friends. Ten toes down, I'll be free until the end. Crib outside the city, I don't feel safe in my hands. Took so many years, I'm just waiting for the wins. I'm in debt to no one but the one who took my sins. I do it for real, there's no reason to pretend. If I do it once, I do it again. Add it up, add it up. Everything is on me, gon' back it up Matter what Told you I'ma do 